for me, this is the moment where I actually start asking questions. Um, and so you sort of pause for a moment and you ask the parents, so tell me more about that. So I'm hearing you saying that you don't want to give the vaccine. Is there something in particular that is making you think he doesn't need it? Or, you know, why do you think your child doesn't need it? And let them explain sort of more about where they're coming from and what their position is. And then it really helps me to answer their questions or to figure out where I might be able to help redirect them to understand a little bit differently where I'm coming from. The most common one I, I've heard is, um, you know, my kid's not sexually active yet or they're not thinking about sex. And my answer to that is, oh my gosh, that's fantastic. They sort of look at me a little bit strange because they're like, why are you excited about that? And you're like, well, I'm excited about it because vaccines are something that you want to give before something happens. And so the fact that they haven't started having sex is perfect because it means that we have time to get in both doses of the HPV vaccine before they're ever exposed, which means it's that much more likely that it's going to protect them against cancer. And for most parents, that's enough to sort of flip the switch a little bit and change their mind.